so can you tell me what you're doing right now? Uh, just getting this thing snug down. What is that thing? Uh, this is the, the fuse holder. Get it so it misses, doesn't hit everything else coming in and out. And still clears this puppy here when it drops down. Alright, so. And what's this piece right here? Is it okay, this is the, the vent solenoid. It vents the, the reservoir so that uh, when it's cooling down, it doesn't pull the water out of your bubbler. So it opens the vent when you turn it off. It closes the vent when you turn it on. So all your HHO gas stays in there to go into your intake. And this is the relay for the power. This is the fuse that's going to feed the relay. And um, then off the relay, you have the actuator circuit, which is going to be operated from inside the dash in our little magic box. Cool. So awesome. Now, <clears throat> you had uh, the, the wires connect going to be connected. How do we feed them through to get them out here? We used the <clears throat> electrician's uh, fish tape and pulled them from inside through the firewall out here. We drilled a hole in a, <clears throat> there's a rubber dam where there's um, other electrical coming through. We drilled a hole right next to it and put the electrical um, fish tape through the hole and then pull the wire from inside out this way. So the uh, black and red wire is right there in the boot. Yeah, there's actually four wires. There's two 16 gauge and black and one 10 gauge and one, let me see. One, the, uh, the black and the red are the 16 and then we have two blacks that are 10 gauge. Okay. All right. And the different gauges are for what exactly? Which which? Well, the 16 gauge, the lighter gauge is <clears throat> one of them feeds power to the switch on the dash. That's and, stuff right there. And the other one feeds the power from the switch down to this relay. The relay will then be turned on from the switch and uh, the other side of that 16 gauge will go to ground. Okay. Awesome. So how soon do you think we'll be finished with this? <laughs> <laughs> we'll answer that some other time. <laughs> yeah, it's a uh, work, it's an ongoing project, so it well, takes a little bit of time. Well, they do say that, you know, the first time is always the, uh, the hardest. Well, that and the fact that we're still driving this car. So I can't just get it started, get it torn apart, and then go on. I'm, I have to keep putting it back together so we can keep using it. All right. What fun.